pretty much almost every other robotics company has like this team of teleop workers, maybe in a different country, that if the robot gets stuck, they can drive it out of its, its dead end and get it going again. And I realized through that experience that that is not a scalable business model. We cannot bring a technology to market that requires experts to help it to help. You should tell that to the Tesla self-driving team. <laughs> Tesla self-driving drove me to work today. So oh. I, I have no problems with Tesla. <laughs> I love it, actually. When I got to Dusty, right, the, um, I knew that in order to make this a scalable, sustainable business, it could not require any, um, any you know, PhD level roboticist to operate. We had to be creating a power tool because that's what our customers use on a day-to-day -day basis. And I'm really inspired by Steve Jobs and what he's done with the iPhone and the whole Apple ecosystem. Like you don't need to go to a class to learn how to use your iPhone. You unbox it, you, you poke at it, you figure it out. And so that's my inspiration for Dusty is I've always wanted it to be as easy to use as an iPhone.